All right, today I got a package from uh, from Ferrum. Well, I crossed out of his name, I crossed my name out. Well, I didn't cross my name out, I, my address. <laughs> uh, so I, he, he told me uh, last week he was gonna send me something, and uh, so I've been waiting for it, and it came. Uh, here it is, so let's um, let's see what's inside. I don't think I need a knife for this, I was gonna break out a knife, but uh, maybe we can just open this. You know what? I'll just crack it open with the knife. There we go. Want oh, some thick paper. Alan's gone green. Or feral, I'm sorry. Feral has gone green. This is a uh, recycled material. Let's see what we got here. Wow, look at this thing. This is a Leatherman. Wow. A Leatherman Wave. Wow, look at this thing. This thing has got some weight to it. Wow, this is really cool. Wow, this thing's heavy duty. Got it right here. So you can see that. Let's see what he's got here. Uh oh. I think I got. Yep. Some of that uh, infamous acorn coffee. I was thinking when I pick up my package today. Wow. You can even smell it. it smells really good. I was thinking uh, on my way home from the post office. What can I do with this thing? I don't want to just make coffee with it, so I'm going to have to uh, read up on this and see if I can make something other than just coffee. That's what he said. Hello. In the baggie is 100% acorn meal. It is leached, dried, ground roasted, and ground again. It is good in my opinion as a coffee substitute. It has no caffeine, but is good as it is as a hot drink anytime. Boil water, pour six ounces roughly into a mug with 1.5 tablespoon teaspoon of the acorn meal and let it set for about five minutes, stirring every couple of minutes right before drinking. No need to strain, no need to strain it, as the tiny lumps, if any, taste <laughs> taste good as is. It is part of a batch I harvested in the West Fork River of Azusa Canyon and San Gabriel Mountains at the site of an ancient oak a man named Seedley Peck had said to have seen Native Americans camped under as a child. He wrote this in his journals and his wife passed them on and they found themselves, the journals, in the hands of Mr. John W. Robinson, who wrote many books of the history of this range. So you will drink of the same tree the elders of this canyon once did. Cheers. Enjoy and thanks for the support of my channel. If not for guys like you, I'd have no reason to make the videos at all, but just walk the trails in silence. <laughs> uh, these videos will be my legacy to this magical mountain range long after I have been recalled to the mothership to go into hibernetic stat <laughs> status for the long ride home. I have a few unfulfilled assignments left and quite possibly could complete them this spring summer. Look for something unlike anything you've ever seen on YouTube. Peace be with you. I don't know what this picture is. Oh, it's not. <laughs> this might just be the paper he did. Uh, anyway, really cool. Look at this thing. That is super cool. This thing is, it feels like a rock. It is so heavy duty. Super cool. I'm going to try to make something other than just coffee with this. I, I've seen Farrell make uh, some kind of a... Uh, Kind of like a cake-like uh, patty. I'm thinking of something on the on the similar lines to that. I'm not sure yet. But anyway, thanks, bro. This is really really cool. Thanks again.